of Transformer Generations Megatron. So here is Megatron. Um, I want to tell you, I did lose the missile. It would be a purple blue tran purple translucent missile. Plug in this, and you would fire this button to shoot it. I somehow misplaced it. Don't know where it went. I'm sorry if I ever find it. I mean, I'll tell you I found it, but I don't know where it went. But um, this is his hover tank mode. And okay, let me get this straight. Hasbro, the guy who created this, very smart. I'm glad what you did. But it looks like, oh my god, guys, guess what? If we fold out these parts, it's like he's on wheels. I understand what you're going with. He's Cybertronian. This is his hover tank mode. Hover. You, you, you just, uh, whatever. Um, again, here's, the, it, it doesn't even roll. Like, if you put this, it drags. It don't roll. Then, plus, you see the hands right there. Ah, <sighs> whatever. So, I don't know. Let's transform. Transform, you take the cannon off. Post it on the side. Because we'll get over that more in robot mode. Take this. Rotate the leg. Out from under here. Fold this. And fold, put that down. Next, you want to come up here. And just fold this up. Take this up here. Rotate it. Head it in. What you want to do is you want to just rotate that down. And there. Next, you want to come up here. Take this piece. Push it up. Just a tiny bit so it's flushed up against his back. Lift the head up. Push the chest piece up. It's basically, and then what you want to do. Um, take the hands out. Rotate them in. I do it, you don't have to do it that way, you don't have to push it in, out like that. I do it, just because it's easier, and then fold it, push it out. So basically there he is, there he is in his robot mode. Let me get him to hold his whole body in frame. Sorry guys, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get it in frame, not really working out to my favor. So, to go over him, this is his articulation, rotate, then you got that, no hand, head, does rotate, does get hindered, not much, but a little bit by the backpack, legs up and down, in and out, Ro knee joint and a rotate at the knee, and then the foot is where his pit goes up and down, and left to right, so he is pretty poseable. I wouldn't say they did this figure and the Wolf of Cybertron Optimus, they did very good on. Okay, and you can plug his cannon on either arm. I plug it on here, because if you plug it here, it looks, I feel like it's too room, too much like junk on it. And then you can pose him like there. Um, I, the detail on the cannon, I think is very nice. If you actually look at it, very nice detailing. I love it. Awesome, as you can see, you, he also does have trend, he has light piping, it's, you can't really see it too much, I mean, here, let me get a flashlight out, what, you guys can kind of see it, but, he does have light piping, he's very cool, I mean, I'd look the mold in on the chat, like his waist, he just, um, he amazes me, this figure on an awesome Megatron, let me show you a comparison. Here he is with another figure that I absolutely believe is the greatest figure on earth. So see how they I think that's a very good size. And then here he is next to full Cybertron, Optimus. And Hasbro, if you're listening, alright? Listen to me right now. Make a full of Cybertron Megatron, the newer version. It is so cool looking, I want him. So I wanna put him in with my war slash full Cybertron figures. But I don't have a new Megatron, so, like, come on, like, please. Plus, make Dinobots, make the rest of the Sectacons. There's so many guys in there. Make Ratchet, Ironhide. Let's make all these figures. Make a Warpath, please. Like, I understand they made a Generations one, but he's too skinny. I'd rather have the big, bulky one. Like, please, make all of these. You can just, 
Oh my god. You, like, come on, guys. Like, you have so many figures you can make. Zeta Prime, come on. Make that an exclusive, please. Just something. Make Zeta Prime. Make Barricade. Drag Strip. Um, who else is there? There's so many guys you can make that High Moon Studios created. That come on. I mean it might be a little too hard to make to get it perfect. But look, you can do it. It takes time, but you guys can do it. And you understand the next because the next wave of deluxe figures for Solo Cybertron is brood is a remold of brood kits. Really? And also guys, can you please put in another kickback in these modes like for the kickback wave with Star Screen, Ultra Magnus, Air Raid, Sideswipe. There's no, I can never find a kickback. Please, I had another kickback. Put at least two in a box. Then put like two, put at least two of each figure. I can never find a kickback, ever. It's so hard to find. I, I was lucky I found Star Screens. Please put a kickback in a box. I'm sorry for this rant ranting, but. Ugh. Anyway, like I said, awesome mold, awesome figure. Go out, get yourself a Megatron, get your well, Optimus, just go out there, Amaz he's an amazing figure, love it. Could be better articulated, there is a, um, a, a company did make, a third party company did make stuff for him, that gave him better articulation, but to me it really doesn't go with colors, it's like light blue, instead of purple. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. But that's really it, all I have to say, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, please do comment, rate, and subscribe. I'll see you guys later, peace.